The storm clouds are gathering here in Ambleside and across much of northern England now. And no surprise, today again we've reached 30 degrees Celsius in the southeast, the seventh consecutive day at 30 or above, and that is record breaking here for September. So and that continues overnight, as do those thunderstorms, which could lead to sudden flash flooding. The warning details are on the website, but frequent lightning around those storms, which, as I say, will continue through the evening and overnight, eventually easing in the south. Good afternoon to you. This September heat wave will mean high temperatures both by day and by night for the time being. By no means straightforward blue skies, hazy sunshine with the cloud cover and the humid muggy air will trigger hit and miss thundery downpours through the next 24 hours. Hello there, good evening. Well, the searing September heat will be drawing to a close next week. Tomorrow cooler, but still very warm for this time of year. And it's still uncomfortable for sleeping overnight tonight. Temperatures at the very coolest point of the night, 16 or 17 degrees Celsius. Good evening. Once again, the weather story has been dominated by sunshine and heat. And for the seventh consecutive day, we've seen temperatures on or above 30 degrees. 33 in Cambridgeshire this afternoon, but increasing humidity brought threatening looking skies and some stormy activity as well. In fact, we had widespread thunderstorms breaking out today. Over 10,000 lightning strikes have been recorded, the heaviest, most frequent across Lincolnshire and North East England. And in parts of South Lincolnshire, we had gusts of winds with those storms, 70 eight miles an hour. Hello again, hope you're all keeping well. So still a chance of thundery downpours as we go through this evening, but for most it will be a more manageable day. The humidity gone quite pleasant with the sunshine in the north. Scotland and Northern Ireland are much, much brighter. But you can see the outlook, the temperatures are a little lower, the humidity's gone, but it's a, a generally changeable showery picture.